Yeah, I was there. Right? Yeah, we were there for the first three days, and production uh, came to a halt because of the uh, accusations between Corinne and Demario. But you know, in the end, everything was cool. Um, when we went back, we do address it. It will be addressed on the episode, and we. Um, you know, it was good. It was a negative situation that was turned into a positive now with a public network, a television show, because, you know, those are situations that people deal with every day. And now someone can watch us and say, you know what, I had a similar situation and I'm not afraid to go public about it. So I think I mean, it's going to be a good And they're not the first show that this, you know, like you guys don't know what goes on behind the scenes. We all have it. We had it for six years on Matchmaker. People were hitting it in the bathrooms, <laughs> drinking. They don't get TV. They don't get, they don't get any type of outside stimulation. So there's no reading. The phones are taken away the first day. And then everybody expects them to be like angels. But then they want you to break, you know, that crazy fourth wall, as of we course. call it, and go crazy. So things happen. Yeah, it was surprising how people reacted because it, it is reality TV, and right. we should assume that stuff happens behind the yeah. scenes. I mean, if you were at a party and you had a pool party and things yeah, were crazy, stuff like this July happens 4th, all the time. Yeah, you wouldn't you wouldn't think twice about it. But because it's on TV, and ABC was very responsible through this process. I mean, I have to say the network did an amazing job. They got them back on track. Everything was cleaned up, and they made their air date. That's huge, yeah. and people were happy. You all want to watch, right? So it's going to be great television this season. It really is. It is. Daniel, were you there when the incident? Uh, no, I wasn't there. You have to watch to find out if I'm on the show or not. 